Did you tell your viewers what we did this morning? We can't tell them things like that. This is a family channel. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning YouTube. So it is Friday, uh, sailing into Alicante and uh, yeah, a last full day on the cruise. Um, so if you watched the last video, hope you did, um, thank you for sticking with the series. Um, we had a little bit of a whinge last night about uh, the ship. Now don't get me wrong, some people may go, who oh got whinging, why are you whinging, you got it on, you got it great on the ship, you know, you got all that going on and you, you moan about silly things. <clears throat> Excuse me, I was singing last night, as you do when you're drunk. Um, okay, it may have seemed a bit extreme to some people, but it's little things on a holiday that sometimes just wind you up. Maybe shouldn't do, but they do. And like any other holiday, um, yeah, there's a few things that, that, that do jar you a little bit. Um, we've been cruising for many years, 22 cruises this one has been, and we've seen a lot of changes. Um, it seems now, uh, with all businesses, you know, it's all about money and profits, uh, as we said, and there, there are a lot of people pushing sales at the moment. On cruises which you don't always want on holiday you know when you get off at some ports you do get people pushing things under your nose and wanting you to buy stuff and it's getting a little bit like that here sometimes you know people have got to hit targets and things like that fully understand but there's the silly things going on as well um, so stuff going up into bar 11 on, the, on an evening and that started on the island escape years ago and they stop letting staff go up to the disco late at night um, we was told it was because of an incident but it seems to have carried on since that point in time um, staff want to enjoy themselves too and it's great that they mingle with the public <laughs> that sounds crazy there's not them and us but you know they come up and they have fun with the passengers as well and, and passengers love to see that you know they, they love to see the dance crew coming up and do a little dance to, to the music and trying to copy it and just you know a bit, a bit of silliness but you know that, that kind of thing stopped which you know is is minor but it does make for a for a good laugh you know and you remember things like that um the deep clean last night as well understand that i mean this ship does run 24 7 and it does run 365 as well so yeah things are gonna need doing you know around days nights when passengers are still awake fully understand uh, but the disco last night you know they closed at one o'clock and okay it doesn't say anywhere they closed at two but it's kind of a norm that it closes around two o'clock and you know most nightclubs in the UK are the same um, passengers were coming up last night and they were coming up nearer one o'clock you know wanting that last hour wanting that last you know, bit of enjoyment and then being kind of turned away and unfortunately for the staff you know they got it in the neck for that you know when people are a little drunk they don't care who they have a go at um, so it, it wasn't great to be honest, it wasn't nice to see that you know staff that work bloody hard and have been up you know, for a long long time and, and worked a lot of hours through the daytime are, are getting that sort of abuse. Yeah. And also, you know, when you had a bit to drink you want a snack too. And you know, couldn't even get that last night, again because of the, the deep clean that was going on. So, you know, it, if it was the whole ship then that, I'm sure there's good reasons behind it. It just didn't make a lot of sense. But anyway, there you go. That was what the, the moan was about, so just to clear that up. Um, so as I say, coming into Alicante, we're still at sea at the moment. We've got, it looks like probably another, I guess, half hour, three quarters an hour before we actually dock. Um, again, I can't really remember if you've been here, so it may be a new experience or it may be, ah, yeah, saw that last time. I know it's crazy, but you know, when you do so many cruises, some of the places you remember, some of the places you don't. But uh, we shall see. Anyway, um, again, another little walk around and uh, probably doing some shopping for Deb today. I've, I've done quite well out of this cruise. I've done a couple of jackets. I've got some shoes yesterday. So um, it's probably Deb's turn today. Right, so I'll do a, a quick pan around of uh, us coming into port. Um, I'm not going to show the ship docking because 
you've seen that already and um, then get some breakfast get ready to go out and uh, see what other county has to offer catch you later I seem to be making a bit of a mess <laughs> Morning. Morning. Alicante. Hot Alicante already. Hot Oof. Alicante, yeah. It's looking good. It is. Yeah, apparently this is the mini Benidorm. Oh, is it? Well, so a lot okay. of people say it's very much like Benidorm. It's more British than Spanish. Okay, so okay. It should be interesting to see. Uh, we should recognise like. some of the shops then. Yeah, I can't it's remember British. if you've been here before. I've, I don't recognise it yet, but it may have been a while ago. Who knows? But, um, yeah, typically Spanish, looking quite nice. Lots of nice hotels, some, uh, some nice scenery, some rocky terrains up there. Yeah, look at that. Don't know where we're going or what we're doing, but we're going to have a walk. No, they did give us a map, but it didn't help because it didn't show us where the terminal bus dropped us off, so we uh, haven't a clue. To be honest, <laughs> we'll just walk around like we normally do and see what yeah. we can find. There you go. Avert your eyes. <laughs> That's disgusting. <laughs> Look at all the fish around it though.
Step, step. A new few this time. Yeah, not too many. <laughs> Oh, Old Town. Ah. <laughs> well done, Mr. R. Shop, not an eatery. Well, to be honest, here you wouldn't go hungry here. <laughs> you certainly wouldn't go hungry here. That's all it is: yeah. bars, restaurants, cafes. Yeah, and then we're going to see. Oh, we There, we're going to see if we can find something down here. Crazy. So we found a shoe shop already. Probably the first shop we've seen. <laughs> oh look, what, what's with the toadstools? Okay. Interesting. <laughs> I'm going to get a pick. Now the paranoid people might say they've got microphones in so they can hear what you're saying. <laughs> Maybe. Um, handbag shop. I oh, know, but it's not the handbag shop I want. Oh. I'm after a Louis Vuitton. Oh, right. I guess it's no good then. Too cheap. Oh, okay. But we're going in there anyway. No. What? Go on. Zara home. Do you want to go in there then?
Seb. Oh. Market stalls. I know, but the one we walked past yesterday was rubbish, wasn't it? Wow. Well, then go that side. No, I'm dragging you away no, from it. No, you're not. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> you tell your viewers what we did this morning? We can't tell them things like that. This is a family channel. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> You're so funny. That's wishful thinking on your part. Oh, by myself. <laughs> Absolutely. Not the game show last night. Yeah. <laughs> oh dear. Now tell them really what we did this morning. Well, what did we do this morning? We packed our cases. We packed our cases. We have to leave the case outside the cabin. And then we don't see it again until it gets to the airport. Oh. Going home tomorrow. Yeah, but it's been a good time. We've had a really good time, but it's going to be really cold when we get home. It's 30 degrees today. Yeah. So hot. And we're going back to about 7 or 8 degrees. We've got used to flip flops and um, Swimming costumes. Apparently there's and... Hurricane Urban Trude or something coming across. Isn't there? Oh wow, great. That's just what we need to go home yeah, to. I forget, oh. I forget what it's called now, but I'm calling it Urban Trude just for today. So we're yeah. hurricane, we've got a hurricane we've coming got, through. We've got a hurricane coming through, yeah. So when we get back to the UK we've got strong winds and I think in the Iron Man they've had flash flooding. It's not coming through tomorrow though, is it? Apparently. No, because we're flying tomorrow. Well, there's not much we can do about it. Could be a diversion to Manchester and a long drive. Oh, oh well. Oh well. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. Ooh, pretty pictures. Yeah. Oh, did it catch a picture? What a picture, what a photo. <laughs> Poor old bloke. Didn't get the bloke. Didn't get the joke. Had flown off in a yeah, hand smoke smoke pack hands. hands. Stamp your feet. Banging on a big bass drum. <laughs> what a picture. What a picture. Dum 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 dum. Stick it in your family. Hey, yeah, album. <laughs> 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 you got a big one. I have got a big one. <laughs> I've got your big one. All right. You've got and you've got yeah. change. <laughs> nice, yes. All right. All right, let's find the seat. Let's go, um, let's go pig out, shall we? Yeah, look at the size of these. <laughs> Limon and Malagata's passes. <laughs> Excellent. It's a good job I saved my most stretch, stretchy dress for tonight, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> They're laughing at us. Hello, Deb. Hello, Aid. <laughs> so, in summary. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's okay. It's, it's all right. It's, it's not a, for me. It's not a bad place, I can't see. Lots of bars. Um, yeah, walking past one now. Lots of bars. You wouldn't go hungry. Probably wouldn't go or thirsty. Or thirsty. Yeah. <laughs> um, the rest of it. Yeah, a few nice shopping streets, a few nice sort of old town back routes, but uh, yeah, nothing that spectacular to be honest. I think a typical sort of Spanish town really, but yeah, nice enough, just not the best place we've visited. No. I guess to sum it up, what do you reckon, Cadiz? Cadiz, yeah. Yeah, Cadiz. Did it for us. Malaga yesterday was nice. Yeah, Malaga was nice. Yeah, that Cadiz was pretty. Was nice. Yeah. 
Yes. Um, well, this is nice, but it's just nice. It's not spectacular. No. I think looking back on all the cruises we've done, still sort of the likes of Monaco, Barcelona, still up there. Montenegro. Montenegro, definitely, yeah. Dubrovnik, quite nice. Yeah, Croatia. Um, all that sort of area there, yeah. Yeah. Um, there's one of the other ones. Oh, um, Corsica as well. Oh, yeah, Corsica, Corsica was Corsica's beautiful. Really nice, yeah. These are good, you know, it's nice enough, but it's just a typical Spanish town. Yeah. Special. Yeah. But, and nice to see. Exactly. And now back to the ship yep. for um, more beer. More beer. <laughs> <laughs> You've got room for more beer after yeah. the size of the ice cream we've just had. My belly's got bigger and bigger. <laughs> oh, look. <laughs> but, yeah, I saved my most stretchy dress for, this, <laughs> for the last night. I'm not daft. I've done this before. <laughs> but we go home tomorrow, so. We do, so we're making the yeah. most of it. Trying to get back on the wagon again. <laughs> oh dear, yeah, that's yeah. going to be hard, isn't it? Starting a diet again yeah. after all of this food. Lose the good half a stone we've both put on, I'm sure. Oh, easy. <laughs> Mind you, we've walked a lot and we've, we've danced a lot. We have, yeah. But I bet we still put some, well, we've put a lot of food away, we have. Yeah, we have. To Not be fair. as much as normal. No. We've got a bit easier. No. But, um, I think it's easier to be good when you go to the posh restaurant than to the buffet. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Right, um, should we drop in the casino? No. No, I don't no, need to get rid of no. all my money. I don't <laughs> like giving my money away. <laughs> Back to the ship then. Back to the ship. That way. Is that the that way, way to... It's over there, look. Oh, right. Good evening and good evening Deb. Good evening. Um, so it's the last night. Cases are packed, almost ready to go. Got to put those outside before one o'clock this evening to be collected and taken down to the dock tomorrow. Um, so the cabin, it's been a pretty... Mess. A, it's, <laughs> we've we've made quite a mess to be honest, just scanning around. Yes, there you go. And um, yeah, we are messy buggers. And to be honest, our cabin boy, who is Jamari, there you go. Um, Done a sterling job. We had some champagne centres earlier in the week and kept putting it on ice. It was uh, it was really nice. He's done really well. Um, the cabin, it's um, it's been good. So the only couple of quirks, I guess, or a couple of things, you put the TV on. And this is a good one. You'll like this. I don't know what channel it's on, but it goes on to some random channel. Uh, and you'll see that a lot. Um, there's not much to watch, to be honest. If you want to spend time in your cabin, a couple of movies a day um, tend to repeat through loops. Uh, but when you switch it on it tends to go to 47 so be very careful you're going to wake anybody up that's trying to snooze and you get that a lot as well it's uh, the tv's not good so one small comment but nothing major the beds um not very soft so the least <laughs> they are they are quite firm so if you're used to a soft bed get used to these because they're going to be um, your beds for a week and they are quite firm and uh, bless the cabin people they took them in like coffins <laughs> so you have to basically yeah you have to untuck them before you get into bed as you you get stuck in bed and you can't do anything loads of mirrors which is a good thing um and you can see the the jacket tonight from expose uh, that's the last the last night jacket uh, so plenty of mirrors plenty of dressing area and i know you're going to be interested because when we went on the dream um <laughs> i did on one of my videos put the share on so i've got to be really really quick i'm going to turn it away because it's going to soak me otherwise. The sharers, to be fair, pretty good. There you go. Lots of water for you. Quickly zip, turn that off. And they do stay at temperature, which is really good. So you can get a nice warm shower and it's not going to turn freezing 30 seconds into it. Um, that's the bathroom for you. So again, really messy. And there's... They provide a hair dryer, which is quite handy. Yep. You don't have to air dryers in there and that plugs into the, the standard socket. Um, what we always do is I've got this block plug with four connections on it 
take the travel plug, plug it into there, and you can see that's the one where the hairdryer's been going in. There's also two there as well, which we could have adapted out of. Didn't, but could have. Um, and that's it, that's pretty much the cabin. So, very adequate. The wardrobe space, more than enough, and you've got long dress side there, you've got shirts, trousers, that kind of thing, and some, some racking there as well. And of course, at the top, your life rafts, which you'd be glad to know if you've not been on a cruise for a while now, you don't have to take when you muster, which is brilliant because we've had years and years of having to put your bleeding life jacket on, on yeah. a muster when it's the oh. hottest day. So you yeah. don't have to do that anymore. No. Um, seating area, of course, we use it for dumping everything on, but mm -hmm. you have got a seating area. So all in all, not a bad space to be for the week. You don't spend a lot of time in your cabin anyway, do you? We you would prefer to be out apart from having an afternoon nap so we can party all night. Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. And now it's up to off to Oscar off to whichever off word to. it was gonna be off to. It's off to forty seven degrees. For dinner. For dinner. Yeah. Tea, lunch, whatever you want to call well, it. Well we didn't have dinner, did we? We no. didn't have lunch. So we're off there now and then party time. Yeah. Ladies. Oh. Cheers dear. Happy last night. <laughs> Hot night. What you got then? Rose turkey, just like Christmas. Hey! <laughs> and what have I got? Mmm, venison. Bambi. <laughs> Bambi. Bambi suffered for my stomach. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers! So what have we got there then? Orange and lime sorbet with caramel sauce. Okay. And what have you got? That is a, a walnut and something rubber. Bourbon pie. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Enjoy. We're in the venue. But anyway, vote now. Apparently we've got to vote for some music, but we can't. Because we've got body parts. We don't want to, because we're going down to the Broadway. Scene.